My name is Z, and if you're watching this, then I am dead. That's, that's pretty much my reality. You know, you're the naive student that is wasting your youth, and I'm the useful, wizened, old, dead guy. Okay, well that's enough reality, let's talk about photo reality. Now, when you're designing in 3D in AutoCAD, you can give your designs photorealistic textures so when you present your designs to your boss, or your boss's boss, they have the maximum impact, okay? So, boom! <laughs> Did you see that? Fine Italian marble. And, but douche! Solid oak! Okay, is it really as simple as just dragging various construction materials from a library onto a surface? Yes! You know, if only the real reality worked that way. You know, I might have the kind of skin women weren't afraid to touch. Or look at. So, one more time. Just open your library of building materials, select one, drag it to a surface. Ah, uh, uh, I've got a little projecty thing for you. Just a quick knock it out assignment, no biggie. Uh -huh. Sure, because your extensive experience as a comic book character qualifies you to assess the scope and complexity of my 3D design projects in AutoCAD. Right, no biggie, just a little thing for the mayor. <laughs> uh, see, she's lost a few points in the recent polls, so she wants to pump up public Confidence. All right, is this another Shepard Fairy ripoff poster? Because no, I just... no, 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 nothing like that. She just needs a killer robot army. A what now? Yeah, 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 fake a killer robot army. That's totally realistic looking in it. With GSF logos on their chests that you would then composite into a video to make it look like they're attacking Dome City Hall. And that she can pretend to destroy single-handedly in a cool laser gun battle in order to further demonize General Shadowfinger and ensure her re-election as the great protector of Dome City from the forces of evil. <laughs> That's all. This little thing. Do, uh, do you hear a phone ringing? That's weird. I gotta go. Uh, also, she'll need a laser gun. Okay, so while TJ was busy implicating me in a devious plot to frame a possibly innocent supervillain and <laughs> lie to the citizens of Dome City and possibly rig an election in the process, uh, I sketched out a robot here in Sketchbook, which I'm now going to bring into AutoCAD as the basis for our 3D killer robot. Uh, by the way, I don't think any of this adheres to current CAD standards, or at least morality standards. You know, kind of a gray area there. But let's start with the chassis here. Make sure the robots have the superior firepower so her victory is that much more improbable. Yeah. Okay, so now we're going to import a PDF underlay of the GSF logo, which I happen to have in my crime files. And then after importing, I can snap to the art, then extrude it in 3D and pop it on the robot. Okay, so let's do that. No, oh, and maybe you could also give all the robots different personalities. You know, like Decepticons. Decepticon. All right, that's it. You know, I, I can't make a killer robot army, all right? It'd just be wrong. I just can't believe the mayor would do this, you know? I mean, she really thought this through. It makes you wonder if, if maybe she's done this before. Also makes you wonder how bad of a guy General Shadowfinger really is, you know? Maybe I could work for him. Maybe the mayor is the real villain here. Oh, and she needs it all before tomorrow morning's press conference. That shouldn't be a big problem, right? But... Okay, so let's just delete this one. You know, boink. All right, because, you know, kill a robot can be interpreted like a million different ways, really. Uh, for instance, kids today, I I've read, use a completely different interpretation of the word killer. You know, they're like, yo, dude, those robots are killer, which I just take to mean cool. So if I was going to design a cool robot, it'd probably be something that you, you know, might have seen in uh, the 1950s, you know, that was all cute and, and you wound it up and it shot sparks out of the top of its head. And can you make sure the laser gun goes with her outfit? And maybe a subtle eggshell white casing that shoots a pumpkin spice colored laser at top, top of my head. I... Variety. <laughs> Sure. Anything for the mayor. So I guess what I'll do is I'll just whip up a little gun that coordinates perfectly with her outfit and with our little toy robot. <laughs> now this is going to be a laser gun fight worth watching. Oh. 